and we will right click to create a new member. The name of the NEM member will be CHAT5EX2. And the member type will be CLLE. Yeah, so member type is CLLE. And here you are. Okay, cool. Program description. Copy this. And we'll paste it right here, okay? Okay, how do you start your program? PGM, right? And then we're gonna have start and end. And in the end, I will have my end PGM. So I'm just creating the structure of the program. One of the reasons I wanted to do this program is that this program, in this program, I will not going to use any variables, so no variables. Second of all, I want to do this example in two steps. So first, I will going to do one thing in this example. We'll compile it and run it, and then we're going to come back and do the second thing. So I want to display the library list. What is the command to display the library list? DSPLIBL, okay, display library list. Send program message, message, the display library list program is save the changes and compile. Once you're done compiling, then you go to the green screen and then you call the CL program. Call chap.ex2, chap5.ex2. Upon entering, what it does, it runs the command, display library list. This is the library list. Okay, and that goes out to the screen because that's what I instructed. I said, display the command output to the screen. When you do not mention the source of output, it goes out to the screen, okay? So now if I press here, F12, it will come back. And notice the send program message is displayed right at the bottom. The display library list program is complete. 